Hello all you shitweeds, Duragast here, and welcome back to another episode of Turmoil. So, we're getting near the end of the desert scenario, and it's going pretty well right now. The last two episodes, in my opinion, were quite well done, so that is always fun, uh, but let's get right back into it and uh, start bidding here. So, we got a 35 and 36 here, as you can see, ooh, 22 down here. We definitely don't want to go all the way south. Obviously, I'm going to go for this spot right here. I'm sure I'm going to be outbid, though. Fucking Ricardo every freaking time. I'm going to rebid on that. Ooh, do I want to go again? Okay, I'm gonna go once more just because the plots of land are getting so dry. So let's see if she rebids. Ooh, there we go. I did spend a lot of money, $6,000. I don't normally do that, but I feel like this is a really good plot of land. So let's hope I can get some good stuff out of the ground. Okay, but now that's done and I'm realizing that uh, my stocks are back to 2%. So I don't know if it didn't save or what the heck happened, but I did, at least I believe I did the stock auction already and it was, yeah, for a 2% share and I won it. Now, I do know what I wanted at. It was about $8,000, so I'm gonna try that again, and hopefully, for whatever reason, nothing changes. Okay, so here we go. A 2% share. I'm not gonna go any higher than $8,000. I don't care if someone else gets it. I'm not too worried about that. There we go. I got it for $7,806. Ricardo, why didn't I press earlier? Of course, Ricardo. I think I think Ricardo's gonna be the one to beat. I mean, he seems to have strategy in his blood. Anyways, we're currently at $25,000. I actually don't know. I don't have anything planned with what I want to spend my money on anymore. So I'm gonna look here and see if we can find something. Okay, I think my best bet is to get cells three for my moles. That's going to allow them to uncover 12 cells instead of nine. Obviously, you want to upgrade that as quickly as possible because you do use your moles quite often. And I think I should use them a little bit more now. So, with that being said, we are at $6,000. I don't have uh, much money for anything else. Actually, let's go to the saloon really quickly, see if there's anything here that I do want. Left ink will never go below 88 cents. Uh, that's actually really fucking good. Uh, stay above 70 cents. Okay, uh, that's good as well. I think I'm gonna go for it. $3,700 sounds like a deal for 88 cents constantly, uh, or higher. So let's try it out, see how it works, and uh, now we can basically sell all season. So hopefully there's a lot of oil in that ground. Okay, January 6th. Come on, guys. You guys are upgraded. You're supposed to be a lot faster now. We did find all three, so I'm going to actually hire another dowser. We're going to get a few loans here uh, because I do want to upgrade as quickly as possible. Let's get another rig down. Uh, you know what? Actually... No, I, I, I do I do definitely want to do two rigs. Look at that connection. My pipe game's still hard, guys. I guess hard was a bad word. Still good. Uh, okay, so we're actually going to build a new pipe to get over to these guys as well, because if I connect to this pipe, then it goes slower and it just takes a little longer. So I'm thinking I should start utilizing the multiple pipes more often now. And look at this. Do I hit it? No, I'm a little bit to the left of it, but we did get really close. So just got to bring this over as little as I can. There we go, 86 bucks and connection that looks like a very small node unfortunately and that is a sexy looking size here oh shit actually <laughs> I should probably get some horses here uh, I do not want to have overflowing issues let's actually borrow a bit more money and I'm going to upgrade those wagons already uh, left things selling for a dollar eight right now that's really freaking good okay but that is a sexy plot of oil let's go a little further here see if we can find the other one I should probably start using my scanner we also got another dowser over here do I actually want to... Ooh, maybe I could... Yeah, I think I'm going to go for this. Going for a different strategy this season. I'm going to bring as many pipes out from one rig as I can. And there is my other plot of oil as well. How is this looking? This looks really good as well. Oh my god, this is going to be a good season, man. Right ink, buying for $1.20. I clearly didn't notice that. My bad. Uh, let's actually hire a few more wagons here. I'm going to hire two more. I think that should be more than enough for right now. We got five upgraded wagons already, so not too bad. All right, we're going to go down a little bit here, and hopefully we can find this other node. And while we're looking for that, let's hire a couple more dowsers. Hopefully they'll find something as well. And uh, yeah, so far so good. Okay, still not finding it. I don't know how deep I should be going. I, f I feel like th these are going to start getting more and more deep pretty quickly. So there we go. We did actually find the other one, and we did strike some more oil as well. Ooh, this must be uh, really low. Let's open up my scanner here, see if I can find it maybe down here. Okay, that's empty, but I have a sneaky suspicion it's going to be actually a bit deeper. Nope, I'm seeing some orange right now, actually, and, oh, uh, man. Okay, I'm going to split off of, actually, let's split off of this pipe over here. I do want to keep as many nodes 
away from overlapping multiple pipes. So obviously I don't want to connect any more here because we're taking two nodes with one pipe. It's going to go a lot slower if I attach another one. Okay, so there we go. We're doing good so far. Uh, we got another guy right here waving. Wow, there's a lot of freaking nodes to the left-hand side here. Nothing so far. I don't think it's going to be any higher up, so we're just going to wait for that one. And there is the other node. Okay, so we're going to bring a whole new rig down here. Uh, to connect to this one as well. It looks like a small node. I mean, I don't really see much of it, so I can't really tell, but I, I have a sneaky suspicion that's not very big. And now we can get a good look at this one, too. This one's actually already almost empty, so that's good. This one over here, totally empty already. Actually, let's hire a couple more dowsers. I think I already did, and they didn't find anything, so I think this is... Everything in the ground, unfortunately. And just for fun, we're gonna hire a couple moles. Hopefully, they, they can find a diamond in this ground. That would be great. I don't think they are, though, to be honest. But there we go. We connected another pipe as well. So we got four pipes off this one rig. This is this is a different strategy than what I'm used to. It's kind of fun. Left ink selling for $1.15. Right ink's going up over to $1.10. It looks like we're gonna do the switcheroo here to right ink. Uh, yeah, prices have been great so far. Unfortunately, my yield has not been that good yet. And let's actually speed this up because I don't think this dowser is finding anything, as you guys can see. Oh, man, $1.24 still? This is great. Yes, the dowsers, in fact, did not find anything else. So, unfortunately, I spent all this money on this plot of land, and it really didn't yield too much. I mean, we got some decent nodes here. Don't get me wrong. This one, actually, we might even want to upgrade this pipe, to be honest. Like, holy shit. Uh, yeah, that's a very decently sized node. But honestly, aside from that, we didn't really get much. And right ink finally did fall, so let's go keep selling the left ink. I guess we can just keep selling at 88 cents. 88 cents is not bad at all, so I'm just going to constantly sell. Don't need any silos or anything for this season. And it doesn't look like my moles found any diamonds, unfortunately. I'm seeing a little thing here, so I kind of want to check it out. But I don't think, no, that's unfortunately a rock. Well, unfortunately, there's not much else to do for this season, so we're just going to fast forward and hopefully finish this thing off, actually... Uh, it's August already, September, October, November, December, still a long time to come, but I think I'm going to upgrade this to at least tier 2, uh, just because there's so much oil in that and I don't want to risk it. And look at that, right ink over a dollar as well. I think I've sold more oil over a dollar this season than under a dollar, and that feels great. We actually did almost overflow there, I wasn't even paying attention. Uh, left ink is, oh, it's actually dropping again, so right ink, god damn, the right ink prices are really good this season. This has been a really interesting season season though I'm usually a big spender and this season I mean all I got is two rigs here and some piping I don't even have a silo anymore so it's kind of fun to try out different strategies this one I mean we didn't get much oil and we're already at $28,000 I probably should have upgraded this to tier 3 because uh, I would have got the last month bonus but I still think we're gonna get most of it out of the ground if not all of it so we should be totally fine here Ooh, this is gonna be close. I'm not gonna upgrade it anymore because that would just be a waste of time. Actually, this one over here, now that I'm looking at it, it's probably... Oh, it did just get empty! Perfect! Oh, I'm, I might do this. Oh, come on. Empty out, empty out. You have got to be kidding me. There was still a bit of oil in the pipes, so therefore I didn't get any of my bonuses, unfortunately. Still, we only spent $8,000 to earn $38,000. Can't complain with that. You can see uh, spendings and profit. I spent a very little amount, and we profited it extremely quickly. Uh, snapshot of the ground. There wasn't any diamonds in the ground, so I'm not too uh, upset about that. And yes, we did get, well, pretty much all the oil out of the ground. You can see there's a little bit in that pipe there, and that's unfortunately what screwed me up. And we do have a, a couple wagons full. So I could have done that season a little bit better, but to, honestly, I can't really complain with have missing a couple wagons. Uh, as compared to the competition, as you can see, kicking their ass once again. Okay, we're going to go back and do another stock auction here. We've got to watch out for Joshua. He's got a 60,000 stack right now. Uh, I honestly wouldn't mind if he would spend a lot of his uh, money on these shares. So a 3% share, I'm going to do about 9,000, I'm going to say. I'm not, I don't really want to win early on, to be honest. So I'm not too concerned right now. I'm just going to wait it out, and we'll see what happens here. Uh, oh. Okay, I was j I just clicked the button, and of course I missed it. Good to know for my memory though, they bid at around 8,000 at a 3% at a share. But that makes things interesting, we're actually almost all tied here. Daisy, Joshua, Ricardo at 4%, and Blanche at 3% now, so so far, so good. And I know you guys hate me saying that, so I'm gonna say it even more.
That's right, bitches. So the next upgrade I want is speed. Now I'm thinking I could buy it right now and just get a loan and pay a little bit of interest. Actually, a lot in interest because technically you're paying 12 months worth of interest. Uh, so I don't think that's worth it, really. I don't really need the speed yet, but definitely later on when we start getting a little bit more crazy, I'm going to want it. Uh, aside from that, there's a lot of things I don't need, like counter herd size 3. I don't think I'm, I can see myself going over 25 horses. And the workshop, I mean, mole speed doesn't really matter to me because I don't use moles to find oil early on, so I don't really need them to be quick. Obviously, size 2 might be worth it, but I prefer doing smaller sensors anyways because they're cheaper. And aside from that, obviously, we got Daphne here who always has some uh, useful visitors, but Gears and Bolts just has timer 3. Uh, again, something else I would like, but I'm not really worth 30000 right now. I'm not having spillage issues anymore ever since I upgraded that to timer 2. So I'm just going to go to Daphne's for this. I'm going to save up for speed for the next season. And uh, we're just going to look and see if we can get anything cool here. So let me some cash in. Left Ink will never go below a dollar four. Oh, man. That is uh, really fucking tempting. But honestly, I'm only pulling about... Twenty to thirty thousand dollars worth of profit, so I don't think spending eight thousand dollars is really worth it, especially when I can generally sell my stuff for eighty to ninety cents without actually buying an upgrade. So we're not going to buy that. Uh, writing seventy nine cents, not worth five thousand six hundred bucks to tell you that much. Reduce next year's interest rates by sixty percent. Maybe I could go for a really aggressive pull. Uh, and utilize that low interest rate. I think that'd be a good idea. And of course, Anthony, we cannot get because diamonds don't like me in this game. So I think I'm going to try this. I don't know if it's going to be worth it or not. We'll figure it out at the end of the season, though. If I spend over like $3,000 in uh, interest, I think it's going to be worth it. Okay, so let's go and go back to the town hall and do a land auction as well. So let's see how it looks here. As you can see, I did bid for the 34 spot, so that was definitely the best spot out of all of them. Obviously, for right now, these two spots are prime. These two spots are big no-nos. So we're going to go right here, and someone's going to steal it probably right away. What are you guys doing? Why? I am really fucking confused. Okay. No complaints. 2000 bucks for, in my opinion, probably the best spot, so that should be just fine. Okay, here we are. The final desert season, guys. I'm kind of excited for that because I do want to go on to the next one. I believe that's when we get gas, and that's going to be uh, very interesting, to say the least. That's when this game starts getting pretty crazy. Uh, we did find one here. We got another dowser guy. I think I'm going to attach it. Oh, no. Actually, now that the other dowser found something, I'm going to put a rig right between them. And as I did state, we're going to spend a lot of money early on, so we're going to to get a $2,000 loan right now because I want to find all these nodes as well as hire some horses. And you know what? Let's just hire some more dowsers right now, why don't we? Okay, this is not a good sign though. I am not finding this first oil node. And uh, that pretty much means this ground is probably dry. Okay, we did find one. Very good size as you can see. Or well, I would say a medium size, but uh, better than most of the ones that I'm finding. And of course we got rock here. So I'm going to censor this up because we got two guys waving here. There's got to be at least one node in this general direction. Perfect. That's a nice size node. Now, I'm wondering... Oh, no. I don't know if I should do that. I think I should just upgrade the drill through rock. At this point, you know, we're going to have to drill through rock anyway, so we're just going to do that and uh, get it over with. And because our dowsers found everything, let's hire some more dowsers as well, and we're going to need some wagons here. So once again, I'm getting lots of loans this season, guys. Uh, how's our prices looking? Not fucking good. That's unfortunate. I'm going to sell a little bit at 66, but again, I can get loans because I'm not paying much interest. And thankfully, left ink's going up so we can actually keep sailing here i was gonna buy a silo but i think i can wait for that for a little bit let's actually start looking oh i didn't mean to buy a silo there i meant to buy a scanner because i want to find this one as well oh i just noticed we did find actually one of the nodes so there we go we can attach to that one and good stuff and let's see what this guy found over here. Anything? Oh, man, this is some dry ground, guys. <laughs> I don't know if I should have bought this uh, interest bonus because I'm not finding much in the ground right now. All right, maybe it's up top. Who the hell knows? Let's find out. Nope, that is just barren ground. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got lots of dowsers waving though. Maybe just maybe there's a mother load somewhere. I'm gonna hire two more, and maybe they'll find something as well. There it is. I think I can see something little there. Oh my god, is that? Please tell me that gets a lot bigger <laughs> downward because I don't know if it's worth a rig to put it over here. But you know what? We're gonna do it anyways. And let's just hope this is the mother load. All right, but where the hell is all this fucking oil? Okay, this guy got to be right here, right? Somewhere? Oh, my God. Oh, and there is the other one. You can see a little smidgen of orange. Good sign. We're going to attach to that one as well. 
Oh shit, okay, oh, thank god I'm selling for $1.15. Okay, but we connected to the other node, it looks like it is a decently sized one. Again, nothing that's blowing me away, but uh, better than these small ones that I'm finding. Like this one over here looks extremely small. Hopefully I'm wrong though. And this guy's still waving, he's been waving for like six months, I feel bad for his arm. There we go, <laughs> that's where it is. Uh, actually, this thing's looking like it's almost empty, so I'm just gonna attach with this one. And speaking of the devil, it just actually got empty, so that was perfect timing. Okay, but lefting, prices are back. Good over there at least prices have been good i gotta be honest obviously demand is lower so i'm going to assume prices would be normally higher so i haven't really sold much under a dollar okay prices as you can see are on par and low so we're gonna start storing some of this stuff and then i think uh, because there's so little in the ground actually it's not looking too bad now uh but i'm gonna start saving some of this and waiting for those good prices because I want to earn as much money as possible. Okay, look at right ink going up. And we got two silos full. That's what I wanted. I'm actually going to hire a couple more wagons and upgrade those wagons because I need to earn some money and I want to sell a lot of oil at $1.16 or higher. Uh, this is a great freaking price. Oh, yes. It's still it's still going up. Oh, is it going to hit $1.30? Rarely does it hit $1.30. But this is fucking nice, yes, I'm actually earning some money for once. Okay, it's down below a dollar again, so we're going to start storing. Left ink slowly going up, so hopefully uh, we can do that once again. We're at $16,000 now. I was a little worried because I didn't think we were going to break $10,000, but now it's looking like it's a little bit better. Okay, I might have made a mistake of waiting. We're on November 21st. And as you can see, I didn't upgrade this pipe because I didn't think it was that big. I just peeked at it and it's still quite, it's got a little bit in the ground. Also, I got two silos full. Thankfully, prices are finally going up again. So I'm going to start selling this because I'm a little worried I'm not going to be able to sell it all. Oh yeah, we should be totally fine actually. Uh, still selling at a dollar though. Not too bad at all. There we go. Yes, look at these fucking prices, right Inc. I love you. Keep going up. Feel free to go all the way to $1.30 again. This is great. And there we go. Oh, come on. Cash in that oil. Oh, fuck. I missed that final oil. Oh, that was a bad season, guys. <laughs> that was not a good season. Okay, well, we earned $30,000 and spent $10,000. And I spent $4,311. And interest, oh my god. Well, it's a good thing I got that upgrade. I mean, I basically got so much loans because of the upgrade, so I did utilize it, but I didn't want to spend that much money. You can see I just actually profited at the end there. Wow. That was a little bit more difficult. Let's see how I pit up against the competition. Is someone going to beat me this time? Oh my god, <laughs> Ricardo's in the red. What happened, buddy? Did you get a dry plot? We're now moving again. This time we're going to the Plains, which has the pro profitable but tricky natural gas let's start bidding oh my god so excited for next episode guys gas is what makes this game in my opinion because there's so much more strategy we'll talk about it in the next episode uh but i did want to quickly check how dry these things were yeah you can see the bottom two i don't know why those guys were fighting for these two because lowest things of all 18 my god but yes guys that wraps it up for another episode of turmoil so i hope you enjoyed this one as always just want to say thank you for watching and liking and i will see you in the next one